you know, what my job and my personal time has kind of taught me over the past couple of weeks, well, actually by the time you guys see this, it'll be within the past almost month, but what they've taught me is that time can be, it can be a gift, but for me it can also be kind of a curse in a way. Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So there have been some recent events that have gone on both in my personal life, at my job, on here, several different circumstances where time just doesn't really favor me. Or I have to, it's, it'll either be that or I have to use up so much time to the point where it just feels like I just, I kind of lose it. Time, it's it's always been me versus time, it feels like, sometimes with this kind of, with a lot of things. And one of the biggest issues I have with, that, that is where one of my biggest faults come into play. Time has never really been my personal friend. I feel like I've always fought against it. Time would, like say, hey, you have to spend this much time longer doing it, and I'll be, I'll get to the point of agitation, to the point where I'll, I'll start getting frustrated at whatever inanimate thing is going on. If it involves an individual, then I will walk away, and when I finally on my own, for the most part, when this kind of thing happens, I'll start cussing out a storm. Now, is this literal? Well, for the most part, no. But my point in saying that is just that I get, I'll get so agitated to the point when I when I'm finally on my own, I will. Whatever is frustrating thing comes to my mouth. That's that's what I'd end up saying. Given the circumstance, it always seems to be something different. But regardless, one way or the other, it does always seem the thing that causes me to get to that mindset one way or the other is time. And over the past, I mean, I'm surprised it took me 27 years to realize this, but time has always been my enemy. Whether for the sake of how long will I be able to handle blank, or how long will it take till a blank bad thing happens to me. I don't know. And, I mean, sure, there are some good things that do go on in my life. Some of them drastically good. Like, life-changing good. Like Amber, for example. Or some things that are just, you know, mind easing good. Like, well, a while ago, I, I, I mean, for different circumstances, like, hypothetically, I, I'm trying to think of something that I can lay out that I was going to use an example that has actually happened, but I was like, yeah, nah. Let's do this. Let's do a hypothetical scenario for that. A job promotion. If I were to get one, it would. It, time, it would take time, but it would end up being worth it, and it would be more a, it would it, be more an optimistic time-related thing rather than not. In that sense, time would be on my side, because in those senses, you do have to have patience. It's unfortunate for me that I don't get that kind of luck. I don't get the kind of luck where time approaches me and it goes, oh yeah, you know what, it's your lucky day. Let's do this good thing for you. It always feels like time is against me and time always is just like, screw you, this bad thing's gonna happen to you instead. This, it might be my mind just over-exaggerating some things, but it really does always feel like that. Time has never been my friend. I mean, 
are some circumstances in my younger life where it was only a matter of time before blank bad thing happened and blank other bad thing happened. It always felt like that. And to this day, sometimes it still does. In a sense, sometimes it feels like Time's basically looking me in the face and going, oh, it's only going to be a matter of me until this big blank bad thing happens. And it chuckles and then just strolls off. I don't know. Yes, personification. I'm going down that road. This is just kind of, kind of where my mind stands when it comes to me versus time. How about you guys? What is your guys' luck when it comes to dealing with time? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, Want to check out any other, I guess in this case we could say about me, type videos. Click the link on this side of my head. Um, if that doesn't quite float your boat, why not check out the other side, where you might find something that YouTube thinks that you might like more. But in the meantime, if neither of those work out, you can always check out the channel itself. However, for right now, I'm going to head off. Thanks for watching this video once more, guys, and I hope to see all of you in another. Bye for now.